Hello, Tyler Ford here, Tucson, Arizona, eXp Realty, and welcome to this episode of Living in Tucson, your Tucson Real Estate Connection. And in this episode, I'm gonna talk about one of the best kept secrets in regards to townhomes on the east side of Tucson, Casa Real. A uh, very desirable place to live, and I'm going to go over why Casa Real is a great place to live and uh, why it's one of the best kept secrets on Tucson's east side. I'm really familiar with Casa Real. I've bought, uh, rehabbed, remodeled, and resold four units in there and I've represented about uh, 10 clients that have bought and sold in Casa Real. Um, and so I'm really, really familiar. My office is uh, literally five minutes away from Casa Real and I live on the east side of Tucson. But uh, one of the reasons I think Casa Real is one of the best kept secrets on the east side of town in regards to townhomes is a couple different reasons. Number one, uh, location. It's located on uh, Speedway and Pantano. Uh, so it's a great location. Uh, number two, the second reason is the HOA, in my opinion, is relatively low in relationship to what you get and compared to other townhomes uh, that are similar. So as of this recording, the monthly HOA is $90 and the HOA, they do a great job uh, keeping up with the front exterior landscaping. They have somebody that comes on a weekly basis. Uh, they also take care of the exterior painting and uh, again, they do a really, really good job on the upkeep up, up keep of, the, uh, of the exterior. And then recently, all the roads have been paved in Casa Real. And within Casa Real, there's, uh, there's two pools, uh, clubhouses, and then um, two tennis courts. Uh, so there's a lot of really good facilities that you can walk to. Uh, it's really close to uh, Trader Joe's, Natural, natural Grocers. Uh, there's a Fry's that you can walk to. Sprouts is just right down the road. So uh, it's a great location. There's a lot of amenities. And again, the HOA is uh, a lot less than other comparable townhomes. And uh, from a price affordability standpoint, um, since COVID hit, uh, all of Tucson has been seeing double di digit appreciation rates. So the last couple of years, uh, the townhomes have really jumped in prices, uh, but you're looking at somewhere in the low twos to mid twos in terms of, uh, in terms of a townhome uh, in Casa Real. One of the reasons I really like uh, Casa Real is the HOA as far as the affordability and what you get. As of this recording, the monthly HOA is $90 and you get a lot for the $90. And if you compare Casa Real HOA to other HOA townhomes uh, similar, the majority of them are gonna be well over $100 and don't, don't even uh, cover what Casa Real covers in terms of what you get. But uh, they do a really good job with the front landscaping. They've got a weekly uh, landscaping company that comes out and cleans and everything is always well manicured as far as the front landscaping. Uh, they also take care of the, uh, the exterior paint and every couple of years they're putting fresh paint uh, and so they do a really good job with that. Recently, all the roads within Casa Real have been repaved so there's fresh blacktop. Uh, there's two pools and two tennis courts and clubhouses uh, that are easy to get to and walk to. Uh, so again, uh, from affordability standpoint, the HOA does a really, really good job. Uh, the one downside is that the townhomes have carports and not enclosed garages. And if you want, if you were to want to enclose the carport to a garage, the HOA doesn't allow you to do that. So, um, you know, positive or negative, just, uh, just to let you know up front, there are carports and not garages. And if you did want to enclose them, you couldn't per the HOA. Let's talk about floor plan and what you can expect uh, when you're looking at townhomes in Casa Real. Uh, there's about four to five different floor plans. There's single story and there's two story. The single story uh, are either a two bedroom, two bath, or a three bedroom, two bath, ranging in square footage of about 1,200 square feet up to a little over 1,400 square feet. And then there's the two story units, which are three bedroom, two bath, which are around 1,700 to uh, 2,000 square feet. So a lot of different op options to choose from. Um, the the, the two-story units, if you've got one that faces north-facing, 
you've got awesome mountain views of the Catalina Mountains and Mount Lemmon. So uh, those uh, two-story units are very desirable just because the view that you get uh, from the second story, especially if your unit's facing, uh, the front's facing north facing. So that's what to expect when it comes to uh, the various units when in Casa Rio. The location of Casa Rio is really desirable. It's uh, on the corner of Speedway and Pantano and uh, you're on the east side of Tucson and uh, to get to any place in Tucson uh, is really easy from Casa Rio. Uh, but some of the benefits, you're really close to Sprouts, which is right down the street, natural grocers, uh, you've got fries that you can walk to, uh, and then Trader Joe's is only about five minutes away. So uh, it's really close to shopping. And then it's also really clo close to the Loop. Uh, which the Loop in Tucson, if you Google the Loop, uh, it's one of the best things that Tucson's done for Tucson. It parallels, in Tucson we have washes and not rivers, and what Tucson did is they put in bike and walking paths along our washways. So there's miles and miles and miles as of this recording, there's probably close to 75 miles of pavement on the Loop, and access from Casa Real is just seconds to be on the Loop and either running, walking, or riding your bike, uh, miles and miles of a pathway with uh, little to no traffic lights and so it makes for uh, especially if you're a cyclist it's really safe because there's no cars so um, that's another big reason why people like Casa Riel is it's close to a lot of things and it's also really close to uh, the loop access. If you're looking to want to buy in Casa Riel, when townhomes hit the market you have to act super fast. Uh, as of this recording the average days on market in Casa Riel is less than five days meaning from the time uh, townhomes listed till the time it goes under contract, uh, it's under five days. So uh, if you're wanting to buy in there, you gotta be super quick. If you're paying cash, uh, you need to have your proof of funds uh, available when you write the offer. And if you're writing an offer that uh, where you're getting financing, just make sure you've got your prequal already set up and ready to go and uh, be able to act fast. And uh, at any given time, um, you know, there may not be listings in Casa Riel. Um, so at most there's, there's one to two listings. And again, they tend to go fast. So again, very familiar with Casa Riel. Uh, lived in Casa Riel, rentals in Casa Riel, and have represented tons of clients in Casa Riel, and uh, have remodeled and resold properties in Casa Riel. So super familiar with uh, Casa Riel, and uh, if you're looking to want to buy in there, we would love to help. If you're wanting to search for homes in Casa Riel, and if you're watching this uh, video on YouTube, you can scroll down into the show notes and there'll be a link there to a blog post that has all the active listings in Casa Riel. And if you're watching this video on my website, again, if you scroll down, there's uh, the active listings in Casa Riel. And again, just keep in mind that uh, there might not be any active listings. So if they're not, uh, reach out to us. We can get you set up on a search. So when active listings hit the market, you'll be notified immediately and uh, we could respond quickly if you're interested in buying a home in Casa Rio. Keep in mind, we've got a 16 foot box moving truck. So if you use us to buy or sell a home here in Tucson, you're more than welcome to use our truck. And even after you close down the road, if you ever need to use the truck to move appliances or furniture or pick something up at Home Depot or Lowe's, uh, you're more than welcome to use our 16 foot box moving truck. Hope you liked this video in regards to Casa Riel. And again, if you're looking to buy a townhome in Casa Riel or any other place in Tucson, we would love to help. Uh, if you like this video, go ahead, give me an internet high five by liking it. Uh, if you have any questions or comments about Casa Riel, uh, you can go ahead and comment below. And uh, for more awesome videos about living in Tucson, your Tucson Real Estate Connection, you can go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Make it a great day.